I'm Brian Fitzsimmons, owner of Fitz's Fish Ponds. When I was a younger kid, I just wanted a koi pond in my backyard, so my parents went on vacation and I just built one really fast, and it just snowballed from there. We're a koi pond company where we build and design and service koi ponds, and we also do a lot of outdoor living, outdoor kitchens, patios, and refinishing some pools. So today it's kind of just the finishing touches, just a little bit of work left, so the guys are just working on small details and uh, finishing up so the project's ready for the customer for next spring. Pretty much everywhere you see uh, new pavement, we've redone. We did the deck right here, the koi pond behind us, upper patio, the sitting walls, the outdoor kitchen. So this has been like a complete outdoor makeover for this client. This project has taken about two months. It would have been three without Bobcat. So we do projects from a really small backyard to uh, you know, big projects like this, and then larger natural koi ponds, really any, anything that we can get to. And, you know, a lot of times we're measuring a gate on an estimate and realizing, wow, we can just fit the E20 through there or just fit the MT85 in the backyard. And it saves us from bringing the wheelbarrows instead. So being that there's multiple elevations here, we had to use the equipment in different areas. So being on the top tier or the bottom tier, moving soil in and out, or just getting pallets from one area of the patio down to the lower area. So just you know, having the different machines for different parts of it was really helpful. We had to bring uh, stone in and then out as well because a lot of the material was different. So we moved about 40 pallets of stone from the old patio out and then back in. And then uh, also we used a, a retaining wall stone, which you see behind me, and that's uh, what we've been moving around and just finishing up today. So we build two different kinds of ponds. One that's like a traditional garden pond, just rock and gravel and uh, you know, like an ecosystem. And then we build a lot of formal features as well, what we did here, and it just fit the backyard. I mean, I think we could have fit a natural pond here as well, but the client has a lake in the front yard. So you know, having this formal aspect next to the curved pool, you know, really square walls made it a lot nicer here.